Three San Diego firefighters are in the hospital after they were seriously injured in a crash while heading to help with hurricane relief efforts. ABC 10 News reporter Ryan Hill breaks down what happened. Now, the three members of that task force were involved in a serious car crash that happened over on Sunday early morning hours. They were on their way to North Carolina to help with that much needed hurricane relief. The crash happening just before 3 a.m. on the border of Louisiana and Texas. An assistant chief with the San Diego Fire Rescue Department says that their team members were in an F-350 pickup and the other vehicle is believed to be an 18-wheeler vehicle. The cause of the crash is still being investigated. A battalion chief and two captains were airlifted to a Louisiana hospital for treatment. The team that was deployed on Friday was a part of a 48 person team in an 18 vehicle convoy heading to North Carolina. They're meeting with FEMA to help out with water rescues. While the names of the crew members aren't being released at this time, an assistant with the San Diego Fire Rescue Department tells us that he was close with those members. Devastating. And uh, it's, it's not something that we ever want to hear in any position in the fire department is to hear one of our own that is injured. Our job is to be to go out there and help people not be part of an incident. The assistant chief with San Diego Fire Rescue says that this is the first time that their task force members have been involved in a serious vehicle accident. Again, San Diego first responders have been sent to various natural disaster sites to provide relief and assistance in those communities. San Diego first responders have been sent to the wildfires in Maui, Northern California flooding and various hurricane relief such as Harvey, Katrina and Irma. In downtown San Diego, Ryan Hill, ABC 10 News.